I, I've got lots of questions on SEO, but it, that's that's just too complicated, um, isn't it? Now, I mean, it, it's still is SEO still re, well? It's reviews. Is it still social? Is it still all the keywords? Ah. what's changed? Anything? Great question. Okay, so what we do is. Remember I told you the first thing that we do, we do things kind of in reverse, we do things in reverse order really. We start with reputation and then we go to, typically we'll go, well most of the time, 90% of the time, we go to local SEO. So what is local SEO? In other words, yes. what, you know, how do you actually show up on the, on the map? Because that's really what local SEO is. So it's 20 to 30% of people will click right here. Yeah. In the ads. Yes. 20 to 30 percent will click right here on the maps mm -hmm. yeah and then and then the remainder will click down here in what we call the organic section okay yeah. now this is the, the reason why and by the way you can see look at this how many mm -hmm. people are searching for this keyword on a monthly basis 1600 the cost per click Lisa is $39 yeah okay? and the competition is 0.68 out of one that, that's pretty high steve came to me five years ago and he said ryan we we just want to get our phone to ring and mm -hmm. i said okay steve I'll, I'll you know there's this new thing called google maps he started showing up here and see they got bought out by mine um mm -hmm. he got purchased by them about a year ago and before they left i can tell you that from these 1600 searches a month he was getting 200 to 300 inbound pre-qualified pre-sold customers saying hey i'm ready to get going i want to just know more about your business i've already seen you i've already seen your ad on google i saw you in the map section with all your reviews and then i went down here and i saw you again in the organic section and i'm and then i went to your website i'm ready to go like like let's what 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 do you, you know how do we sign up basically so what that i'll just put a just give you guys an idea here what the, what that means now is it <clears throat> we conservatively estimate in terms of dollars what that what this what showing up here on the map really means to them for for a for an area that has that kind of search volume let's say their conversion rate was let's say it was like what you got to convert at least five and a hundred right so yeah. right okay so yeah. five and a hundred that means 10 new doors a month and each new door it could be multiple but let's just call them just count them as one okay so let's just say it's one new door each door is worth about it's worth about three thousand dollars a year on average that's conservative and then um you multiply that times three years because that's the average length of time they keep these doors that's nine grand let's just round it off to ten Okay, round it up to 10. So each one's worth 10. That means if you, if they're getting 10 new doors a month, that's a hundred, that's 10 new doors a month times up $10,000 in value, life, lifetime value. That's a hundred thousand dollars a month that this is meaning to their business that this, that just showing up here like this with this number of reviews, because look, no one's really close to them. They're, they're a, like head and shoulder, you know, winner when people see this result here, there's, there's no one else they're going to call. That's a, over a million two in, in revenue, in, mm -hmm. in actual revenue per year. So I just want you guys to understand like how important this is. Now you might not be in an area that has this kind of search volume, <clears throat> but I, <clears throat> I can still tell you that over time, this is like the tortoise and the hair race, mm -hmm. you know, the, the, the hair, doesn't always win. It's not always the Google ads. This is why we actually start with the, with a, a, the other strategy first. We want to build your reputation so that when people, and then we do your local SEO so that, because we want you to show up here on the maps, we want you to show up on the maps with a great reputation. So we show, we work on that first, then we work, we work on your local SEO and then we, we run your Google ads because typically you're going to see, and I'll do another search here for property management. Let me just do a search for property management, San Antonio. Just, just while you're doing that, I mean, you know, it's important for Australia here too, because 
um, you know, to show up in the three parts, as you said, to show up in the, in the paid ad, to show up in the Google map, and then to show in the organic search. So you're on three times. Um, yep. Like we don't have, um, we don't have the, um, the same system, like the multi-list system that you have over there. What, what do you call it? Not multi-list. What do you multiple, call it? Multiple, multiple listing surf. Yeah. Yeah. Multiple multiple listing surf. Yeah. Yep. yeah. Yeah. So we don't have that. So as an agent, when we promote a property, we actually also attract the buyers. So it's, there's not really buyers agents. We attract all the buyers. So to be able to go into a listing presentation here and to be able to say, this is the way that we're going to attract the buyers. You type in this suburb, you know, like real estate agents in Runaway Bay where I am. And if I'm, if I'm on there three times, well, who's going to be attracting the most buyers? You know, who else would you list with? Why would you go with anybody else if right. I'm on here three times? You know what I mean? Absolutely. Um, so it's also a listing tool. It's not only it's not only the the people that you attract from going to the page. It's also um, you know, but by, by telling owners that you are going to be attracting those buyers as well. Absolutely, Lisa. It's in other words, it's, so it's it's the owners and the buyers. When because when the owners see that that you are going to be the one that's going to adequately market their their property because people are going to see your company and therefore it's going to be increasing the likelihood that they're going to sell their property through your company then they're going to go with your company because they know that that the buyers are going to want to that are going to potentially buy their house are going to want to go and work with a company that actually has a great reputation so it works both ways like you said mm -hmm.